All right, so I've received a ton of comments asking about a particular skin. So obviously with Fortnite Chapter 5 Season 2, this is the battle pass right here. We've got Poseidon, Artemis, Zeus, Aphrodite, Hades, Cerberus, Medusa, and the secret battle pass skin is Korra from Avatar. But obviously one major god is missing, and we even saw him in the cinematic trailer. And that is none other than the god of war himself, Ares. So he's currently a boss on the map. In fact, you can get a medallion of Ares. But clearly he's not a skin in the battle pass. In fact, a lot of people are a little bit upset because they wanted him as the secret battle pass skin and not Korra from Avatar. So if Ares is not in the battle pass and he's not a secret skin, where in the heck is he and how do you get him? Well, if you watched my patch notes video yesterday, you already know because they let us know in the official patch notes. Let me show you right here. The God of War, Ares, always welcomes a battle. Take him up on his challenge in the Brawler's Battleground Arena south of Mount Olympus. And here's the most important part in parentheses. It says, oh yeah, Ares will be the outfit of the April 2024 crew pack. So that is 100% officially confirmed that the next crew pack in April is going to be none other than the God of War himself, Ares. So obviously and understandably, a lot of people are upset about that. They teased him. He was in the trailers. And then he wasn't even a Battle Pass skin. You got to pay a little bit extra for the crew just to get him. Now remember how these past few crew packs have worked because he's probably going to be the same way. And what I mean by that are the legacy styles. So for the past few crew packs, Cat here included, this is how it looked. You get the skin right away. Then the next month, which you still have to be subscribed for, you get a unique style to that skin. And then for the next four months, which you still have to be subscribed for, you get the same styles for all the crew skins. So you got a gold one called Auric. You've got a holographic one called Phase. You got an ice crystal one called Rhinebound. And lastly, you get a galaxy one called Cosmic. So that means to get all the styles, you have to be subscribed to the crew for six months. It doesn't have to be in a row, but just six months and eventually you'll get all those styles. So I can totally understand why some people are mad that Ares is now in the crew. So I just wanted to test something real quick. I wanted to go in game as Mystique and try to defeat the boss and see if we can get early access to the skin. I think it should work with bosses, but we'll find out. He's not the easiest boss to defeat, but he's also not the hardest. He actually riffs in, which is really cool. Okay, so just in case you're not familiar, you have to go up to the statue and you have to challenge him. You smash it on the ground. Then that makes him really mad, but first you have to defeat the minions. Then he spawns in. Now he comes rifting in. Check this out. Straight from the top rope. Look at that. It's like a fireball coming down. And I think he can rift. Whoa. That's cool. I think he can rift in the middle of a fight as well. Let's see. We took out his minions again. So he looks pretty sweet. First of all, let's see if we can transform into these guys. Look, it's me. I'm your friend. I'm your friend. It's me. Okay, that doesn't work clearly. I want to see him rift during the fight. Come on, rift. Do something. Does he have any special abilities? He said, make this worth my while. Why don't you make it worth my while? Come on, do something cool. No, he's not. Okay, say la vie, old pal. So he drops the Warforged Assault Rifle, as well as the Aspect of Combat. So this basically increases all damage of ranged weapons. Okay, so here we go. Let's shape shift. And there he is. Check that out. Boy, he looks amazing. That is a wicked cape, too. Let's look from the front. So he kind of reminds me of a souped-up Black Knight, doesn't he? He's got a gold and black and maroon color scheme. That's real clean. So you can see that the very end of his cape has a little bit of fire effect to it. It looks like it was burned. And then his helm has a flame effect as well. He's got two little wings coming out of his helm, too. It's not a bad skin at all. In fact, the maroon turns a bit red in the daylight. Check that out. So let's look one more time from the front. He's got the orange glow. The armor looks incredible. Like I said, it totally reminds me of a Black Knight skin. Not bad at all. Unfortunately though, like I said, it's gonna be a crew pack skin. 
So there you go. That is the God of War Ares and how to get him. Again, unfortunately, he's going to be behind a paywall that is the Fortnite crew. Looks like a pretty solid skin. He can sit on his throne if he wants. Not too shabby. So there you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is Tabor Time.